Hello, YouTubers. Mommy Ray Ray. Today, I am preparing for you tilapia fish. Um, My son loves this fish. I'm going to make this fish and show you guys how I do it. I have my cast iron skillet heating up, and I'm going to make potatoes. I'm going to cut four Idaho potatoes, and I'm going to use fish seasoning to season my fish with. A lot of people will go ahead and use their own seasonings, but I figure this is complete when I use this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my oil in so that my skillet can be getting hot. So what I'm going to do is fill this up halfway. And this is not gonna work because it's too slow. So I'm going to grab my oil and I'm going to fill it. I'm using a cast iron skillet. And I am filling this up halfway. Most people like to use their cast iron skillet when they fry their fish. And I put it maybe not even halfway up, but in there. And I'm also going to put the rest of the oil for my potatoes in. All right, I'm going to show you how I season it, all right? So now I'm grabbing my fish seasoning and I'm going to season each piece of fish. Okay, I'm also going to turn them over and season them on the other side. Okay, let's make sure each piece of fish gets some goodness on there. This is what's going to cause the fish to have the goodness. A little garlic pepper. Okay, not a whole lot guys, just enough to just get it so that it has a very good taste to it. Alright, All right, guys, so this is my next step. I use Drake Crispy Fry Mix. This is awesome for frying fish, chicken, and anything you fry with. This is what I use. It's excellent to fry fish with. So, I poured some of that into my bag and... I am about to take my fish and I'm going to put it in the bag and I'm going to shake it. Each piece needs to be coated. While my skillet is getting hot, I am shaking up my fish and getting it ready to put into the hot skillet. well coated guys like I said this will be some awesome fish and you can also always check to see if your um, oil is ready put some in there this baby is ready okay so what I'm gonna do here I'm gonna put the fish in the grease and I think I want it to get a little hotter, guys. So I'll be back after this get a little hotter. I'll be back. While the um, grease is in there getting hot, I am cutting up some Idaho potatoes because I'm going to have fish and french fries. So it's just basically I'm just taking it down and I'm making homemade french fries, guys. Very easy, a really nice sharp paring knife. Cut them, and now that's all I'm doing. Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm gonna put my fish down in the hot grease.
And it is frying, you guys. And as you can see, it's not going to take very long because the grease is extremely hot. It's taking the place of, of deep fryer. I love cast iron skillet. A beautiful piece of fish. So guys, that's basically it. You're going to put it in your hot grease and I'm going to come back and show you the finished product of my fish. So I know some of you would want to see me take it out. So guys, I'm taking it out. And look how beautiful that is. This is how you fry your fish. This is how you make great fish. Guys, now I'm going to put those potatoes that I cut up into my hot grease and we'll have fish and french fries, like a fish and chip. So, I'm putting these in guys. Once I finish, I'm going to show you what I have here. All right, be right back. Okay guys, my potatoes are ready to come out. And the reason why I'm showing you this is I think that people are gonna wanna know. Once mine start to get brown around the crisps, you know that they're done on the inside. So I'm going to unload this and Ray and I are going to show you guys how to eat this. I'll be right back. Okay guys, this is Mommy Ray's fish platter here. I immediately poured a little Lori seasoning salt on top of the fries. Just a little bit. Some people may want salt. Some people may put Lori onion powder, garlic powder, whatever your preference is. We'll show you how to eat this, guys. Don't move. Watch this. Okay, guys. This is the finished product. And Ray and I are about to sample it right now. All right. So... Here's Ray's plate. Here's my plate. We didn't bring any forks or spoons in here, Nothing. guys. So we're about right, to dig in. Okay. Wow. Now, most of you, I know your moms probably had white bread with their fish because it is good. White bread is excellent. But today, I'm going to have a piece of wheat bread. And I'm going to dig in. This is how we do it. And we got some tartar sauce too. You want some tartar sauce? Mm, mm, mm. Okay, guys, I'm cheating. So, Father, thank you for this food. Bless our bodies with it. Let it digest well in the name of Jesus. Okay, guys, so we're going to dig in. I'm going to get me some hot sauce. I got me tartar sauce. Mm. This is not that good. Mm. Mm. You don't want that? Well, I'll take a little bit. So it's really easy, guys. I know some people like ketchup on their fries. Ray and I eat them like this. Oh, yeah, regular? Just regular. So it's pretty tasty, guys. Hope you enjoy the video. Don't forget to subscribe, give me a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys soon. Thanks. Mm.